All right, watch the ES. We have a potential speed tick trade on the ES now that it's confirmed that that line. Also, it got a rock star, so I shorted it. It confirmed that that uh, resistance has merit to those that are trading. And there's plus five. So that's just a straight up rock star trade setup. And these uh, shorter bars here than this big up thrust bar. And uh, another one that may have been bigger, but it ran into this resistance. So we got slammed in here, uh, tested this line to make sure that it was resistance. Tested the other side a little bit, pulled back, opened here with the rock star. Less than five ticks from this resistance, so that qualifies it as a rock star trade. And down it goes. Um, it actually would have qualified also for a naked rock star trade, but that's how it's done. All right, so we had the big blue on the GC, and then we had no speed tick on this bar and now we have a medium blue so this is actually going to qualify if we get a rock star all right short at the uh gc got a one tick better fill yep there's my plus five so here's the uh channeling okay this is what we do every day breaks out of the channel pushes up hard gets up here pushes up the ho this high of the day which is minor resistance for us but it still counts as resistance bar you see how this this bar went from black to a light to a, a dark gray to a little bit lighter gray then it's overbought which is the pink outline at the speed tick and the pullback alert this bar open five ticks or less from the high of the day with a rock star and down it went so we got our plus five now you got a second shot at it right here I actually didn't get this but I think some of you probably did this is a second trade setup. This is not a different setup. So we had a speed tick on this bar. This bar open. Rock star. Down it goes again. So we got a, a, a double hit right here. Both of them winners. 